Well, hello, friends, and welcome back to more with Marquita. I know it's been a long while, but I am so glad to be back. I've actually been busy working on a career change, taking some nursing classes and trying to get into the nursing field. And I've kind of neglected myself a little bit. So I thought, what better way to get back to myself than to start with a new facial and facial waxing. So here's my routine. Let's get into it. So friends, you want to start off with a bowl of warm water, five white hand towels, white because they carry less bacteria. My dermatologist highly recommended it. Two facial cleansers. I use brightening and oil base. A facial scrub. It would be nice if you add a little vitamin C. Hard wax, a toner, olive oil, and a moisturizing mask. You want this towel to be as hot as you can stand at. The hot towel helps loosen the skin and debris. And then next, I'm gonna exfoliate with a brightening cleanser. I got this from an esthetician that I tried and I got it as a trial regimen and I got it for half off. And it has um, so many options, but tonight we're just gonna use this brightening wash. I like to start my facial off with a brightening cleanser because it gently exfoliates the skin. I like to have a lot of, a lot of lather. Ah, oh. oh, this feels so good. And then we're going to rinse with another warm towel. Next, I'm going to go in with my Kiehl's cleanser. I got makeup all over it. But this is a smooth and oil to foam body cleanser. I use it on my face too because all fights all fights all. I do have a little bit of acne popping up so i'm going to use this for my first cleanse wet my hands a little bit more I can't find my face scrub, so I'm going to use this Tree Hut Vitamin C. It is a brightener, so that's good. Using a facial scrub helps remove extra dirt and also dead skin. With Vitamin C, the benefits are more antioxidants. Vitamin C also helps with discoloration. I use this on my face and I also scrub my lip. So it's time for hard wax. I have two wax machines, one mush. I got it from Amazon and it keeps going out. I think it may have a shortage and I have a GG from Sally Beauty. And I just use that one when my one from Amazon is not working. I prefer the Amazon hot wax machine because I can control the temperature of it. The GG is only one temperature. Be sure to get extra spoons. I only use one for stirring and I use my extra to put on the skin. Never put a spoon back that you had on your skin into the hot wax. I try to place my hot wax on in a downward motion and then when I pull it off, I pull upward. I let the hot wax cool and then I pull upward.
After the hard wax is pulled off, apply pressure to your skin with your hand, and this helps the nerve endings recover. Next, I'm going to go in with a second round of hard wax to make sure I get all Super hair removed. Bumps. Just on the area that you shave or wax. Tin Skin is a must-have product. It's a really strong alcoholic toner that prevents... This is my favorite. Um, it's Body Hydro Gel. It's just coconut water and aloe vera. To soothe what I just did to my face. And lastly, some type of moisturizing mask. This is me relaxing and it feels good. So my face is nice and soft and moisturized and no more hair.